Oh, hey, YouTubers. Today I'm going to show you how to properly read a hydrometer and uh, use it for things like calculating how much alcohol is in your wine. So um, what I've got here is just my standard triple scale hydrometer. So you can get these at any brew shop. They're about six or seven bucks. Um, and it's just a little glass instrument that has three scales on it. So it's got um, bricks, it's got uh, percent alcohol, and then of course it's got specific gravity. So depending on what your use is, you might choose to read one, one or the other of those scales. I know winemakers usually, um, professional winemakers work in bricks and home winemakers a lot of times like to use specific gravity. So, something you'll see on the side of your hydrometer is a temperature that it's calibrated at. This particular one is calibrated at 60 degrees Fahrenheit. And I know here, this is some Merlot, but I know my juice is at about 67 degrees. So, um, we'll have to make a little adjustment and you can get a table online for the adjustment, but here, what comes with the um, hydrometer is a little chart and what it basically says is um, if you are at, at about 67 degrees add point zero zero one to your reading so that's what we'll do and basically what that means is you know if your juice is warm your hydrometer is going to read a little bit um, low because you know warm things like to expand a little bit and if your juice is cold it's going to read a little bit high. So we're just taking a sample here. It smells really good. I can smell it from here. Everything here has been sanitized. Something really smart to do. All right. So we've got our hydrometer. It's floating in the tube. And sometimes it's kind of hard to get it to float. So what you can do is kind of give it a little spin but I just try to kind of center it as good as possible. So we'll get up close here, and this is probably about what I expected, but it looks like we are reading about um, 0.994, so we're pretty dry, and I'm taking that reading, it's kind of hard to see on the camera there, but you have a, a meniscus that forms against the side of your your hydrometer tube here um, so it's just kind of how the, the wine just kind of rides up the wall of it a little bit and you just want to make sure that you read to the bottom of that meniscus to get your reading to measure the alcohol content what you'll need to know is your original gravity that you started at so I don't know what this one was I'll have to check the notes but let's say it was point one one point one zero zero what you would do is you'd subtract your final gravity from your original gravity and um, multiply that by 131 so um, that's the better way to calculate it I think you can also read the estimated percent alcohol on the side of here but the thing is with this particular hydrometer it uh, puts at, at 1.000 specific gravity, it says 0%. And, and in reality, a lot of times your wine will run cold or run, um, you know, lower than 1.000. So that's where the little calculation comes in. So original gravity minus final gravity times 131. And that's how you um, calculate just pretty accurately um, how much alcohol is in your wine. So um, that's really all there is to it. That's how you read a hydrometer. Um, thanks for watching my channel.